Enough time keeping up with repairs before all this nonsense with the atom lunatics. They're nothing you need to be concerned about. It's not them. I'm concerned about you, Dima. You can't solve all the world's problems. Certainly not all at once. Dearest Faraday, relax. All will be fine. So, you've talked to Dima. You know why we're here. I certainly hope that you'll consider helping us. Dima's vision is worth fighting for. So, you're a Sith? I am. I hope that's not a problem for you. Dima has worked hard to create a place for us where we can be safe from those who don't accept us. He's put so much of himself into this. All his time and energy devoted to helping others. He never stops to think of himself. Sometimes I worry about... Well, if I wasn't here to make sure his equipment is all functional. And that's not even mentioning maintaining the fog condensers. So many things to keep track of. Right. Right? Wouldn't want him blowing a fuse. Huh? Uh, no. Not really. Dima looks like he's had a lot of work done. Well, that's certainly an understatement. Between the two of us, we've made so many modifications. He was just a prototype, never built for all this. It took a lot to overcome the limitations of the original design and expand his memory. It really is remarkable, isn't it? He's overcome so much. He's become so much more than he once was. And all he thinks of is others. If there's anything I can do to help out, just let me know. Well, if you're determined to help, there is something you could do. It's likely somewhat dangerous, though, so I understand if you'd rather not. There's a boat along the coast of the island. It was transporting some hardware we needed. Storage drives. The boat never finished the trip, you see. So the drives are still out there. I could really use them here, for extra parts, if nothing else. My understanding is that the boat wrecked southwest of here. So, does this sound like something you could handle? What happened to the boat? Why didn't it make it? I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. Trappers, fog crawlers, there's no end to what's out there. And what might still be out there. But the point is that we already lost someone once. And I don't want to see that happen again. So, are you up for it? Sure thing, Faraday. I'll get the drives for you. Thank you. I really do appreciate it.
Hey there. Yes? I've got those storage drives you asked for. Oh, that's great. Thank you. Uh, just the two? Really? I somehow thought there were three. I did notice a locked chest that I couldn't open. Maybe the last one was in there. Do you have the key? Key? Chest? I'm afraid I don't know. I, uh... You know what? This is fine. Just these two is fine. Well, you did your part, so I'll do mine. Thank you for recovering these. Hey there. Yes? Tell me about yourself, Faraday. Me? I don't know why you care. I escaped the Institute, just like others here. Never had my mind wiped, thankfully. 
I like to think I came along right when Demon needed me. I found him before all this, before Acadia. He needed my help, though he refused to admit it. He's always been stubborn like that. Anyway, I've been by his side ever since, making sure he has everything he needs. I'm sorry. Never mind. Okay. 